Hey, on for tweaktown.com in Vegas at the CES 2016 and at the Samsung booth we're having a look at the new Samsung Galaxy Tab Pro S. I was introduced over here. It's a tablet or also a convertible because there is also an optional keyboard dock. Uh, with that you can use it like a notebook. So let's talk a bit about the specs. We have a 12 inch display. It's a super, super AMOLED display. So from the colors you can see it looks pretty good. We have a full HD plus resolution so that's 2160 by 1440 pixels and as a processor we have an Intel Core M processor it's a dual core with 2.2 gigahertz 4 gigs of RAM and also 128 gigabyte storage for the user the battery has a capacity of 5200 milliampere hours so this will um, bring you up to 10 hours of battery life it also supports LTE CAT6 and from the connectivity we have Wi-Fi 802.11 AVGN AC with my Wi-Fi Direct, NSC and Bluetooth 4.1. From the cameras, you have a 5 megapixel camera over here on front and also a 5 megapixel camera at the back and the back is non-glossy, what I prefer and it feels really good. All in all, the build quality is really nice of this device. It feels super nice. It's super thin because it's just 6.3 millimeters, so that's really, really thin for such a device and it just weighs 693 grams, so it's also pretty light. Let's go around the device a bit. We have a USB type C over here. The headphone jack on the top. You can find the volume button, the power, the volume button over here and the power button. And over here is the Windows button. So if you press it, the Windows 10 menu will pop up and you can um, work with it. So all in all, I think this is a really nice device with Windows 10, an Intel Core M processor. Super thin, super light. It's really for people who are always on the go if you're on the plane and the train etc and with the optional um, keyboard dock I think you're pretty much um, yeah really happy with it and you don't need a notebook anymore so this is the new Samsung Galaxy Tab Pro S that was introduced over here at the CES 2016 in Vegas thanks for watching